Hi, I'm iBog from the Boxy Community Forums. You're watching my Boxy video tutorial. Do you store all your movies, TV shows, music, or photos on your Mac? Well, you're in luck. I'm going to show you how to share all of those files on your Mac so you can view them with Boxy running on Linux, Mac OS X, or your Apple TV. Step one, let's first go into the system preferences and click on the network icon to check our settings. Go to advanced and then the wins tab. Here we have the NetBIOS and workgroup names. Now a workgroup is just a collection of computers on your local area network that share common resources. Workgroup happens to be the default setting used for Windows, Mac OS X, and Boxy. So here we're really just checking to make sure that it's correct. The NetBIOS name is the name your computer will appear as in the workgroup. So when you're browsing the workgroup network from Boxy, this is the name that Boxy will see when it sees your computer. I have mine set to MacBook. You could make yours media server or whatever you want. Go nuts. Once you're done, click on OK and then apply. Step two, let's create a folder for storing our media. Now, if you've already done this, you can wait until step number three. So I like to store all of my media in the shared user account. The reason I like to do this is because my computer is used by many people. And uh, when other people use my computer, uh, they can always access the shared user account. And so the media doesn't have to be in multiple locations on the hard drive. So let's create a new folder. We'll call it media. And because I like to, to organize my content, I'm going to create a subfolder for videos. Let's create another one for photos. And lastly, let's do music. So there we go. We've created our folders. Now we can go to step number three. Let's, let's share our folder now. So again, back to the system preferences and click on the sharing icon. Here, we're going to enable the file sharing. And once it's enabled, we can drag and drop our media folder from Finder into the shared folders dialog box. Next, I'm going to go to the options and I'm going to enable the SMB file sharing. And I'm going to disable the AFP only because I'm not using it. And there you have it. So I've just shared the folder so that everyone on my network has read-only access. If you And no one's going to be asked for a password. Now if you wanted to change this, this is a little bit more advanced than I'm sure if you clicked on the help uh, icon in Mac OS X, you can figure out how to authenticate users. And that's it. I've just showed you how to share files on your Mac OS X system so that it can be viewed from Boxy, whether it's running on Linux, Mac OS X, or the Apple TV. You're now ready to go to Boxy and start adding new media sources and browsing the workgroup and adding this new network share. So please come and visit us at the Boxy Community Forums at forums.boxy.tv. Let me know what you think of this video and if there's any other topics you'd like me to cover. Thank you.